When designing this boat, we really had in mind to make the boat as easy and as fun for sailing. And that's why you can see you have very, very clean cockpit with just the minimal number of control lines needed. But of course, they are still all what you need. Starting with the details of the boat from the bow, the boat is having a furling jib, which makes all the handling, living in harbor and coming back in much, much easier. And at the same time, it also allows you to reduce sail area on the water when the wind got stronger or too strong. And that situation, you just simply move the dagger board position from front slot to the backwards, and you still have a perfect sailing experience and a very, very neutral helm with no, with no compromises. Very important part of the Jeep, which is very, very different to the alternatives on the market, is definitely the self-tacking Jeep, which makes solo sailing with full sales configuration completely effortless and really, really easy, even for the beginners. When designing the cockpit, we were really trying to simplify it, all the control lines as much as possible. And as you can see, you have completely clean cockpit. All the control lines are centralized around the mast. And here you have Vang, which is really powerful. Uh, and it's of course turned around, so that area under the boom is completely clean and easy to move. Then here, the second one is the Canningham standard control lines. And surprisingly, compared to the alternatives, you also have the jib, uh, jib sheet here on the mast. The rest of the control lines are just, uh, just, there are just two more in this area, is the furling line for the jib, and then the endless uh, Janaker hoist, which is also the, uh, the retriever line for the snuffer back on the other side. The boat is equipped with cat rig, standard in carbon, of course. Mast is rotating together with the boom, and there are two things which we'd like to point out. First is the upside down bank, which makes the area underneath completely clean and much, much easier to move. And then the second is the mainsail sheet attachment. Usually the mainsail sheets are fixed on the deck floor, while here it's fixed on the boom. And this is important for two reasons. One is that you have completely clean area and one huge cockpit. And the second thing is that as you can move the dagger board position, in this situation, you also need to move yourself. If you're sailing solo, you move forward. And in this case, you just move the mainsail sheet attachment forward so that it's on hand according to your sitting position.